We've explained in other videos how to make different discounts, for example, 10% off A and 20% off B, whether A or B are products or collection. We've also showed how to make tiered discount, meaning if you buy 100, you get 10% off. If you buy 200, you get 20% off and so on. Now I want to show you how you can mix both tiered discount, applying different discount on different products or collection. And I'll also show you how you can be, you know, go a bit, uh, let's say further with some more complicated stuff using combined deals, those stacking deals type of custom deal. So first of all, I'll show you the end result. So the end result is a combined deal. Combined deal is something you can go here and click of multiple stuff. So basically these guys would like to have 10% off the entire order. So including the other promotion promoted products or discounted products. Then they want to have, f uh, if they have five units of product A, which is compost, they would like to get $30 or 30 Indian dollar off. If they have three units of compost of so product A, they would like to have $20 off. So these, this is a tier discount on a specific product, but it could be on a collection as well. If they have five units of Adidas shoes, they want a hundred off. And if they have three units of Adidas shoes, they want $80 off. The simple way to do it would be to switch the fixed discount of dollar off to a percentage discount, because this way it would allow every unit of the five units to be discounted by, let's say 30% off instead of $30 off, which by default in Shopify will only apply the $30 off once uh, on one unit. But it's 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 possible to do both. But this way, using fixed dollar rather than percentage, it's a lot more complicated. And I'll show you what we did. So, <clears throat> for example, we took the first one, specific items, the five unit compost. We created thirty dollar off, applied on multiple quantities on a specific product. But like I said, it could be on a specific collection, and then. Um, we added a cart requirement that this specific product should be bigger than five. That is pretty simple. Let's go to the other deal, the three compost. So we did the same $20 fixed amount, apply to multiple quantities and to this specific product. But here we added a double cart requirement that the cart needs to have at least three of this compost product but four or less than this compost product. Because other, otherwise, if we don't do that, then if we combine the deal, if we stack the deal, the customer will get the $20 off for three and will also get the $30 off for five if they have five or more items in cart. But I don't want that because I want a tier discount. I want $20 off if they have three or four and I want $30 off if they have five or more compost product. We did the same logic for the other product that added us. And then we created another deal that is called whole order 10% off pretty straightforward, nothing fancy here. And at the end of that, we created a, a new deal, which is called combined deals. Here, you would see listed the five deals that I've just showed you. Uh, but you don't see them because, you know, I've already created them. Oh, and yeah, I forgot. So here, how we should combine the deals. In this case, it's all the deal together. But in your case, it might be only the best deal for each item. And here, if you over that, show me an example text, you see the difference. So let's say I have a 10% on the whole order and a 15% on the collection t-shirt or product t-shirt. If I combine all the deal, then the t-shirt will have 25%, 10% plus 15% and 10% on anything else in the cart. But if I just use the highest one or the best one, customer will get 15% on the shirt because 15% is better than 10% and will get 10% on the rest of the order. So in this case, I've selected all the deals and I came up with this beautiful deal that I renamed deal, which is a combination of the five deals here. 
So if I go to test it, actually, I think I already tested it. So let's say I have five compost and ten, uh, five added us. Then I get exactly what I showed you before. So I get $30 off the compost multiplied by five, which is 150 and 10% off the whole order, which is 90. So 90 plus 150 is a 240 discount. Same thing here. I get a hundred dollar off per unit of added out shoes. Multiply by five is five hundred, and ten percent of five thousand is also five hundred. So I get a thousand dollar discount. So a thousand dollar plus two forty is a a thousand two forty dollar discount off in this currency. So this is exactly the deal. And if I switch and I put three, for example, I should get. 3 multiply by 20 off so 20 off multiply by 3 equals 60 plus 10 percent of 540 is 54 dollar 54 plus 60 is this number 114 and same thing for added as two so this actually works but let me show you how it could be a lot simpler using a different type of deal so actually, I'll only need one deal or two. So I will select the tier discount. And rather than selecting fixed amount, I'll select percentage. So the only thing you would need to define here is if you would like this to apply on the same variant, the same product or anything. So any three products in cart. In our case, it was the same product, but the same variant would have worked as well. So let's say I have three quantity of a specific product that is called compost right here then i get instead of 20 dollar i get 10 percent off i'll use the same uh, number uh just to you know to be consistent i could also select a maximum discount amount let's say it would not want to give more than 60 something like that so I think I just broke my mouse. I'll just pick it up. So then uh, here we could make it a bit more obvious, but you can stack another deal, which is another tier. And again, it's the same compost product, but I would like five units instead of three. And here the order, like whether I put five quantity tier and then underneath three or three at the top and then on the bottom five it doesn't really matter or app uh, script is smart enough to differentiate and instead of 20 i'll give 30 percent and again i will select uh, compost product here i can do the same exact thing with the added else product now and i can also do the same exact thing for the whole order the 10 percent if i have a collection called our product but i would recommend to create another deal instead of the tier deal right here then you you create what i just did you save you click on custom deal you create a new deal called a whole order and then i'll show you actually whether so let's say i create this deal okay so i'll do it later but i want to know here what is the deal so i could actually change the deal and I could call it like a uh, tiered discount instead tiered. Okay. So I have tiered here and then I will create a new deal, whole order 10% and I'll call it 10. Okay. Just to make it clear. So now I have 10. Do I have 10? No, I didn't save. I'm stupid. So I have 10 here. I click change. I will scroll down right there and I'll do it later to automate it because I don't want to automate it. I just want to combine the 10% with the tier discount, which would actually do the same thing as what I did, but a lot simpler just because I'm using percentage rather than fixed amount dollar discount. So I'll create a new deal, combine deal. I have my two deal. I select them. I would like to, them to stack and I click the create deal. Then I'm prompt to actually automate the application of the custom deal because this will not work if manually input in the discount field at checkout in Shopify. So I would like it to automatically apply 
and I would like it to trigger, for example, if the number of items in cart is at least three, either of added as or um, the compost product. So, and, and the rest, the custom deal will be smart enough to check if there's three or five or no product. And then I can test it, I can put it active, and I will, re uh, I will reach, achieve exactly what I want in just a different manner, in a very simpler manner than the first way I've described in this video.